and you're welcome back. Now, the Borg Oil Storage and Transport Company boss says it will reshuffle its workers as part of measures to curb incidents of adulteration. A driver and nine vehicles have been impounded in connection with fuel adulteration at the Kumasi depot. Eight other drivers are still at large. Management say the police are currently investigating circumstances leading to the incident. Here is the managing director of Boss Edwin Provinco. Normally in our operations, when the drivers come into our, uh, our terminal to load, we test the products and we load them. Then the moment they leave our facility, the responsibility of the product is transferred from bust to the transport owner who has to ensure that the product gets to its destination safely. They are paid for the transportation. The moment the product gets into bust, Kumasi, it is transferred to us again. So we believe strongly, and I'm sure the investigations will reveal it as well, that the, con the adulteration happened when we handed over the product to the transport owner, who is represented by the driver. Because their cars are also sealed by NPA. And any time there is a tampering of the seal, NPA gets a notification. So between the regulator and uh, the transport owner, they take responsibility. And the regulator monitors, the transport owner takes responsibility till the final destination. So this was done outside, bust. That is why when it got here and we tested it again, we saw that no, this product was of a different density. And so something had been done. We also realized that the color of the product had changed. And that is what prompted, that raised the alarm and got our people uh, to call in the authorities to bring us where we are today. The products have been impounded and all the night tracks are in one location. The police have come to see them, MPA have come to see them. And so, yes, the products haven't found their way onto the market. So the public should be rest assured. Uh, we are enhancing the SOPs. Uh, we are also what we are also trying to do is uh, we are trying to transfer our staff across our depots. You know, when you stay in one place for a long time, you get too comfortable. Mm. And so uh, these are some of the internal uh, decisions we'll be taking in the near future where our staff will be moved across our depots and then uh, strengthening the processes as well.